1998, I used to work uh, still at Tulika Books with Indu, and uh, I'd been working there for about four or five years, and I'd actually got sick of publishing. So I quit my job at Tulika, and I went to the party and I said, I want to be a you know, whole timer or I'll do full time work for the party. And then Prakash told me that they are planning to set up a publishing house and they wanted somebody to set it up basically. I think it was a left project that was long overdue. In the old days, there used to be PPH. And PPH, as you know, collapsed, particularly after the end of the Soviet Union. PPH had played a remarkable role. I was an undergraduate student in Delhi and I know that PPH books used to be really kind of much anticipated, much bought, much discussed and so on. After its collapse, there had been few kind of small ventures like Social Scientist Press brought out a few books and so on, but they never really had taken off. So when Leftward was being thought about, it was quite exciting and, and, and so I promptly agreed to it. We will publish books on Marxist theory, we would publish books on the ideological debates of the time. We would publish books uh, about left-wing uh, movements and struggles uh, around the world. You know, there was this whole idea of setting up a publishing house that would be uh, like the Victor and Golangs of the British Communist Party, for instance, and the kind of association and distance that a publishing house would have to have necessarily between, uh, uh, you know, publish what is squarely left Marxist in its ideology and yet be acceptable to a wide readership. And then we used to have these long, day-long meetings, which were most exciting. The meetings were attended at one stage. N. Ram was involved, Ajaz was involved, I was involved. Prakash, of course, would be always there. Sudhu Sudhanva would always be there. Indu would be there. V.K. Ramachandran used to be associated. So, so it would be, I mean, not that all of them were there in every meeting, but, but it was quite an, an, an exciting gathering of people. शुरुआत ऐसा हुआ कि बारह राजेंद्र प्रसाद पे पहला ऑफिस था लेफ्ट वर्ड का कुछ नहीं था क्योंकि तब तक तो ये था कि इन्हीं रूम में अपना पब्लिशिंग हाउस चालू करना है पब्लिशिंग हाउस की शुरुआत हुई पेंट करने से कि चलो व्हाइट वॉश कराते हैं दरवाजे पेंट करते हैं रेड कलर के दरवाजे पेंट किए गए इनिशियली आई थिंक वी ओनली एट वन कंप्यूटर ओल्ड यू नो बिग डेस्कटॉप एंड देन Prakash had decided already what the first book is going to be. We started with the publication of a book called A World to Win, which is a collection of essays on the Communist Manifesto and its relevance to the contemporary world. This book also had an interest, according to me, a more interesting section on how the Communist Manifesto came to India and how it was first published in different Indian languages. Fortunately, just before we had done the book, Prakash had already decided that we would have a book club. And so the first working capital actually came because we immediately, as soon as the book club scheme was announced, we got some two, three hundred people who signed up immediately. And so the first book came out of that money. Very soon with Sudhanva at the helm, they were amongst the earliest adopters of technology to service customers. So we had an e-commerce enabled website at a time when some of the big publishers in India didn't even have a website. This was 1999, 2000, 2001. We had dial-up modems, we, had, we didn't have broadband connection, connectivity. We would be delighted if we'd get one order a week on the website. You know, if you got four or five orders in a month, you'd be, yeah, great job, guys. At that time, it seemed like a very bold move. It was a left publishing house emerging at a time when left thinking was really on the decline. And so it was bold because it had an ambition that we can actually not just keep the flame burning, but resurrect it almost and expand it. In many instances, we were the only publishing house which published against the tide of opinion. For instance, when the India conducted the Pokhran test, the nuclear test in 1998, we brought out books arguing against India's nuclear weaponization. I think the first book that I produced for Leftward was War Against the Planet, 
uh, which was written in a very, very big hurry uh, to meet uh, deadline so that we'd have a signpost uh, out on the attack on the United States in 2001 and the war against Afghanistan. Over a period of time, uh, Leftward has also uh, done some very, very interesting publishing which one wouldn't associate uh, directly with only left-wing politics, which is in the cultural sphere, uh, broadly, in the international progressive cultural sphere. So, the book on Palestine, for example, on the Freedom Theatre, you know, the two volumes on the Freedom Theatre. In fact, some of our best-selling books uh, have been written by what would be not considered as left uh, writers or journalists. Uh, for example, A.G. Nurani's books, they are the some of our best-selling books. His book on the BJP and the RSS was truly uh, made a big impact, you know. I have seen people from other political parties, you know, quoting from his book, you know. Professionalism of leftward and a small publishing house is much higher in terms of the editing quality in terms of the personal care that is taken in the production of the book and the marketing and the publicity of the book, no corporate house gives that kind of attention. Thomas I the book, I forget the name, that for that book, uh, Sudhu was searching for the cover page. So, uh, the different op uh, opinion were the, then at last Sudhu took one photo, uh, five of us uh, hand like this, we got different hands. जैसे किसान लॉन्ग मार्च है ये महाराष्ट्र वाला वो किताब अपने आप में बहुत बड़ा चैलेंज था तो वो किताब हमें पार्टी कांग्रेस में जो हैदराबाद वाली पार्टी कांग्रेस में देना था और हमारे पास टोटल शायद सात दिन था ये पता नहीं था कि पहुंचेगा नहीं बस ये कि हम कर रहे हैं कर रहे हैं ये बिल्कुल नहीं पता था कि पार्टी कांग्रेस में पहुंचेगा नहीं पहुंचेगा जो होगा देखा जाएगा बट हां फाइनली पहुंच गया और कॉमरेड अशोक ने वहां रिलीज किया था वी हैव आल्सो देन गॉन द नेक्स्ट स्टेप मेनी ऑफ आवर बुक्स आर then translated and published in other Indian languages. We have not ever charged any, you know, royalties or anything. We, they just have to get permission from us and we have allowed them to freely publish. So, so many of our books have been published in Telugu, Tamil, Malayalam, etc. From the very beginning, we were keen on entering the publishing of Hindi books and uh, with the addition of Shipra, uh, our Hindi book list is going to start expanding quite dramatically, not just translating the English books into Hindi, but I'm very excited that we're going to start um, commissioning original books uh, in Hindi, uh, Marxist books, left books. Uh, I think there's an enormous appetite inside India uh, for books in Hindi of and from the left. So I think that this <laughs> is a new approach in our जो लेफ्टवर्ड ने जो प्रकाशन का काम शुरू किया एक नया अध्याय खुला है और इसमें बहुत मजा भी आ रहा है और बहुत अच्छी प्रतिक्रिया बहुत अच्छा रिस्पांस भी मिल रहा है तो अब देखते हैं आगे कितना हम लोग इसको लेकर के चल सकते हैं इन अ प्रीवियस ऑफिस वी हैड वन शेल्फ वेयर वी यूज्ड टू कीप आवर बुक्स एंड दोस बुक्स वर केप्ड बेसिकली फॉर पैकिंग पर्पसेस and then because our book club also expanded to start selling other publishers books like Tolika and others so we started keeping their stock as well and those books used to be kept on that shelf only so that the person who would do the packing could take out copies of whatever was required and then somebody would turn up and start looking at the bookshelf and say oh can I buy this can I buy this and you would say yeah sure you know just go right ahead and then I found that more and more people somehow word spread and more and more people started coming in to a point where literally every day there was one person who was dropping in just to buy books. And I realized that, wow, there's a need for an alternative kind of bookstore. So then I was determined in my head that as and when we have space of our own, one part of that space, however large it is or however small it is, one part of that space is going to be a dedicated bookstore. And I remember Sudhanva telling me with great delight when the architect of Prithvi Theatre visited him, Ved Sagan, and Sudhu took him around 
the, the studio and the made a bookshop and the little office space. And Ved turned around to Sudhanva and Sudhanva was just so delighted that he said, Ved said, you've, it's beautiful because you've actually thought of the flow of the human body through this space and that's why it works. Setting up a bookstore in a place like Shadipur, uh, anybody with a business head would say you're an idiot to do that. And of course, one is an idiot. A cafe and bookstore and perhaps a theatre space in the middle of that neighbourhood would be really breaking the everyday rhythm of that place. Disrupting it, but I think disrupting it creatively. Because they are who they are, local bachcho ke liye classes, rickshay walo ke liye classes. Where would you find in Delhi a space in which the proprietor or his or her team wants to chat about just any old book? Janam will also have plays, will also have performances, uh, you know, like not just music or theatre, but j just like a single person, one person show yeah. in that space on the side. One last time, Jai Bhi. बड़ा इंपॉर्टेंट है और उस पे क्या है कि फ्री कोई भी घुस सकता है तो लोकल बच्चा घुस के वो देख लेगा शायद उसका कभी ऐसा देखने का चांस ही नहीं मिला होगा जिंदगी में कि अच्छा ये भी होता है अरे समथिंग वेरी स्पेसिफिक टू मेडे कैफे एंड बुक स्टोर इन शादीपुर ऑन मेडे ऑल दीज थिंग्स दैट कम टुगेदर दैट मेक्स इट पॉसिबल फॉर मी टू वन मेक एंडलेस कप्स ऑफ कॉफी एंड नॉट फील टायर्ड अंटिल आई स्टॉप मेकिंग द कॉफी then the tiredness sets in or to be able to say uh, what I wish to say which I haven't always thought of previously now uh, so there's a spontaneity but that spontaneity is rooted in in what's happening at May Day on May Day. <laughs> We have found that leftward books, there are people who come to leftward books, become readers, or associate themselves leftward, who have not come from the organized left or have not been part of any movement, but they have this thirst for knowledge, they want to know. A nation does not exist if it doesn't think. And you know, and, 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 and obviously these fellows are interested in preventing thought altogether. So it's very important for publishing houses like Leftward to survive and work in this very hostile environment, all the more important. The idea is to keep going forward because only independence can go forward without self-censorship or any other form of censorship on the freedom to publish and the freedom to express. If Leftward can continue to exist for the next for the coming years and continue to do this innovative thing, they should just conduct more masterclasses with others. I mean, the challenge of leftward has been what has excited me uh, all throughout. The challenge of producing high quality Marxist and left wing books for a general public, for a general reader, for young people, for scholars alike. And I think that has been really the most exciting thing. Um, you know, close to that, of course, is the team. I mean, we have such an amazing team. उनके लिए ये एक काम नहीं है, उनके लिए ये एक मिशन ही नहीं है, बल्कि लिए इसमें उनको मजा भी आता है, उनको उनकी रुचि भी है, और कुल मिलाकर के उनका जो उत्साह है, वो उनकी हर चीज में दिखाई देती है, जो बुकमार्क्स हैं, उसमें दिखाई देती है, जो झोले हैं, जो पोस्टर्स हैं, ये बुकशॉप है जब उनके लोग जाते हैं किताबों को लेकर के जिस जोश के साथ वो किताबों का वहाँ कि वहाँ चर्चा करते हैं तो दिखाई देता है कि ये लोग मतलब पूरी तरह से इन किताबों के साथ जुड़े हुए हैं इन विचारों के साथ जुड़े हुए हैं उनको मजा भी आ रहा है इनके प्रचार में The key issue for us as always is the politics of what we do and so therefore we want to be in a position where we are able to help movements on the ground 
uh, and produce material that would help them in conducting their struggles. In order for that to happen, we need an expanded team. In order for that to happen, we need to be able to publish, certainly in Hindi, uh, in a much bigger way and who knows what the future holds, but certainly English, Hindi, both have to become much bigger and we have to be able to respond to things as they unfold in a much more life kind of a way, to be able to be more flexible um, in how we respond to things um, and so on. So I'm hoping that with this really exciting new team that we have now suddenly, I'm hoping that we are looking at more exciting days ahead. मैं लेफ्ट वर्ड की माने का तो लेफ्ट वर्ड के लिए